So it turns out that India isn't just buying GPUs to power its AI future, but it's building its own AI infrastructure backbone. The Ministry of Electronics and IT just shortlisted seven firms for the second round of the India AI GPU tender, which happens to be one of the biggest compute grabs in the country's history. So the shortlisted companies are NetMagic, which happens to be a Google Cloud partner. And then you have SciFuture India, which is approved by the ministry. Then you have Sifi Technologies, Vencisco Technologies, which is backed by AWS. Then you have Locus, which is also tied with AWS. And you have Yota Data Services, Ishan Infotech, which is backed by Oracle. They're now invited for a technical presentation on May 14th, which happens to be the final gate before a 10,000 crore rupees worth of compute is handed over. So the ministry expects to procure 15,000 GPUs through this round. To put that into perspective, that's more than 14 times the capacity allocated in round one. And according to the bids seen by the Economic Times, the combined offers have already crossed 14,517 GPUs, all at L1, meaning the lowest rates. So when Cisco, AWS and App Squads are offering 2,000 NVIDIA H100s, and then you have 100 AWS Trianium chips and 200 AWS Inferentia 2, and as a bonus, over 1,300 GPUs over their last bid. Locus, which happens to be one of the top L1 bidders in round one, is back again with a new strategy. Will the details remain confidential for now? And SciFuture India has 1,184 GPUs in the pipeline. And this consists of NVIDIA H100s, L40S, then you also have the A100, you also have AMD's chips, the MI300, the MI325, and then from Intel, you have their Gaudi 2 and the Gaudi 3. So SciFuture AI is already building a homegrown platform. Look, it's not just about hardware, right? Because these GPUs will power India's sovereign LLM efforts, which includes Servam AIs, 70 billion parameter multilingual model and also a population scale gen ai deployments then of course the secure cloud native public infrastructure and with countries like us tightening gpu exports india is racing against geopolitics to build a self-reliant ai muscle so what's next so in may 14th you have technical presentations and post that there's the final selection and just announced is the round three of the gpu tender it's already open. And what is the next phase of India's AI revolution, you may ask? You'll witness it at Cypher 2025 this September 17th to 19th in Bengaluru. Because the future of AI won't just be made in Silicon Valley. So got your tickets yet? Link is in the comments. And this year's Cypher is dedicated to one big mission, which is building AI in India. So if you're a founder, drop a comment telling us what you're building, and we might just feature you next. This is Front Page by AIMTV. See you in the next update soon. And you already know what's coming, which is Think AI, Think AIM.